Hey guys, welcome along to the pretty cool vlog. You've made it back. Or it's your first time, so don't forget to subscribe. Here we are, we find ourselves in Animal Kingdom. This is just where we're starting today because we're gonna do a Walt Disney World snack venture. We're gonna go to all four parks today and we're gonna get snacks from each park that are exclusive to those parks. This is JR's pick. He got the baked macaroni and cheese with pulled pork. This is from this is from Eight Spoons. This looks pretty all right. All right, JR. Take a bite. Good. It's really good. So far, the general consensus is that it's pretty darn good. I'm gonna give it a shot. Ah, uh, ah, uh huh. <laughs> Just like that. That's delicious. I really like macaroni and cheese. I like barbecue. So for me, that's an obvious win. Eight Spoons Cafe, Animal Kingdom. And next, we're gonna find something else. And while they continue to enjoy that, let's take a look around. You can see the sky today. It's a little overcast, which is kind of nice, keeping the temperature down a little bit, but it is raining. I don't know if you can see that on the uh, water there. Water droplets. That it's, uh, it's keeping the temperature down, so it's not too bad. And then while we, um, you know, while it's raining a little bit, we actually have a little bit of cover. We're, we're down by the tree. See the tree of life there. We're down on the back side of it. A little trail you can come through. It's pretty cool. It's right along the river here. That's pretty cool. See this little trail? comes up check it out got a nice serene waterfall with the tree of life in the background look at that look at that beautiful shot the overcast sky in the background that's purdy that's purdy plenty of beautiful creatures Hanging out, Animal Kingdom. All right, so next up we're stopping at Mr. Kamal's for some of Mr. Kamal's seasoned fries. We're about to pick up her right here. And waters, because it is humid. Still overcast. these seasoned fries. Man, they look pretty all right. All right, so we got some of these uh, Mr. Kamal's ooh, fries, seasoned fries. Check that out. Nice close-up shot of that action. That's uh, like some seasoned fries, tzatziki sauce, and uh, like a sriracha ketchup. We're gonna give this a shot. This was over at Mr. Kamal's across the river from the Tree of Life. You can either go on one side or the other, cross the bridge. We came over, we came over the um, the bridge to Africa, walked around there, found it, got him. Now we're gonna eat them. You ready? Cheers. Very good, but really spicy. I like spicy, so not to me, not to, not spicy to me. All right, so my reaction, it's it's they're they're pretty good. But the flavors are all good. Like I like the mix of the flavors and the contrasting cold and spicy. But it seems like the fry, I don't know, maybe the fries aren't super fresh, maybe. And they might be better if they were a little crispier or whatever, or hotter at least. Um, eh, it's pretty good. Definitely different. So if you want to try something different, that'd be a good one to try. Let's go see what else we can find. As we leave Africa, we just came from Tamu Tamu, a little sidebar across the side of the bridge. That's where yeah. Jessica got her uh, a Dole Whip with dark rum. Whenever you come to Disney, you always have to get a pineapple Dole Whip, but get it with rum, dark rum. You can get it dark rum or 
coconut rum, but I'm not a fan of coconut rum. This is really good and refreshing. Yum. And it is really dark outside, guys. Mmm, try that. Mmm, rummy in my tummy. Oh. <laughs> this is our last snack at Animal Kingdom. Next, we're gonna head to Hollywood Studios. So let's see what we can get there. Soaking wet, guys. We're all soaking wet. We run the bus from Animal Kingdom over to Hollywood Studios, and as soon as we stepped off the bus, the sky opened up and just. Now we're eating though. So back to our snack venture. So we made it over to Hollywood Studios. We were gonna go to the Brown Derby Lounge, but it turned out that they were closed because of the weather. So we decided to come on down to the uh, the market. What is this? Sun sunshine? Shun sunset. Sun, sunset Boulevard Market or something like that. The Sunset Ranch Market. That's where we're at. Sunset Ranch Market. And they got a couple of uh, windows you can go to. And we picked the one, the All-American, I think it's Rosie's. Rosie's All-American Cafe. Yeah, Rosie's All-American Cafe. And we got a uh, fried green tomato sandwich. Trying to stay in line with the get something that's only, or that's exclusive to the park. So we're gonna try this fried green tomato sandwich. I'm don't, pretty sure this isn't anywhere else, so we're gonna try it. Looks like pepper jack cheese, fried green tomatoes, tomatoes, and lettuce, and some kind of sauce. Oh, or the jalapeno ranch sauce. All right, there we go. It's good, but I think it's weird that they put regular tomatoes in here. Oh, I said lettuce, but I meant spinach or arugula. arugula. I had green. Well, I've been, uh, I keep wishing for this. A rainy day in Disney. Kept saying it. Kept saying I wanted, I wanted it. And we got it. It's definitely a wet day in Disney. Right now it's not too bad. Not too bad right now, but. All right, so basically that was our snack from Hollywood. Now what are we gonna do? We're gonna go back to the hotel and change clothes. Even though we wanted to go straight to Epcot, I am very uncomfortable right now. We're gonna change clothes. Still I'm the so same day. So we're gonna go change. We're gonna go change. We're taking a little pit stop. Yeah. Then we'll come back. Back out. See ya. And now we're at Epcot. Just walking around in the rain. We're gonna get some snacks. We're gonna come up to the land. Go to Sunshine Seasons. They have a really good bakery, so yep. we're gonna see what we can find in there. So here in the land, there's the snacks we got. JR got him a, uh, an Odwalla frozen lemonade. Then we also picked up, this is a peanut butter and jelly cupcake. And then also we picked up one of these whoopie pies. That looks pretty awesome here. And we also picked up a uh, cold brew coffee. This is from Sunshine Seasons. all this. I'm not sure if you eat that or not. These are real flowers. I don't think I'm gonna eat those. They're really pretty. All right, I'm digging in. It's like peanut butter and jelly. All right, so there is actually peanut butter and jelly inside. All right, so now we got the, uh, the whoopie pie. Like I said, it looks like red velvet cake with some of that wonderful whoopee filling. All right, so. Yeah, that's 
good. That's good. A lot of filling in here. That's really good. I don't know what to liken it to. It's yummy. Here's Mickey. Look out there. Guardians of the Galaxy is looking pretty epic over there. We're done at Epcot for now. We're gonna head over to Magic Kingdom for some snacks to continue the snack venture. Hello, everybody. This is a churro icing sandwich. My mind just broke. Sleepy Hollow in the Magic Kingdom. How do I? How do I eat this? We are in our last bit of our snack venture. This is what JR is gonna have. Well, all of us. My pick. Is it good? Mm hmm I imagine it being like a cinnamon bun with ice cream on it. I thought it was going to be like very it. crunchy. And just one thing about it. That Whoa. There's ducks everywhere here, y'all. Like JR said, I thought it'd be crunchy, but it's really not. This is this would be a breakfast dessert. Dessert for breakfast. And here we are at Fryer's Nook. And we are looking at the buffalo chicken tots. Loaded buffalo chicken tots. Those are tots and those are loaded. We're gonna try them out. Goodness, there's so much buffalo sauce on here. Ah! <laughs> Yummy. It's not that spicy. I mean, it tastes like buffalo, but to me, it's not spicy at all. all right, I'm gonna give this thing a shot because I love tots. I like buffalo chicken. This should be all right. Some, some chicken and. Ah, oh, fight. Yeah. We're waiting. <laughs> Man, that's pretty good. That is good. I gotta say, we're a little unimpressed with the churro sandwich. It was basic. Yeah, it was very, very basic. Didn't hit the spot. This actually hits that's, the spot. That's it's like, like something a, different, you know? That's not really. Did you like it? Mm -hmm. Like, it didn't have like a lot, but it had like. This much spice to it. So this like is cook. coming from a kid who only used to eat chicken nuggets and french fries. I kind of recommend it for a bunch of other people. I think this one wins. Yeah. Me too. Magic Kingdom wins the snack venture. And we're going to end our snack venture here at Magic Kingdom. It had the best snacks, I gotta say. Definitely had the best snacks of all the ones that we chose anyways. There's plenty of snacks, other snacks you can choose. But as far as this trip, this snack venture, loaded buffalo chicken tots, those things won. Thank you guys for coming along. It's been a fun, exciting day rainy. full of rain and uh, other adventures. So if you liked it, hit that like button. If you want to see some more, just hit that subscribe button. Tell us your favorite part, dudes. Yeah, tell us what you like to eat. On that note, we're gonna call it a day. Yeah. All right, guys, as far as we're concerned, that's, that's pretty, pretty cool. cool.